A deep breath as Idalia swirls away from the North Carolina coast, but not before leaving its mark. Good afternoon to you. I'm Jeff Hogan. And I'm Renee Chu. As of the 11 a.m. advisory, the center of circulation is 85 miles southeast of Cape Lookout. Numerous roads are closed due to flooding near the coast. The biggest rain totals locally were in our southern counties. Clinton at almost four inches. Hope Mills in Fayetteville over three inches. We've cruised stationed up and down the coast. WRO's Kelsey Coffey is in Wrightsville Beach, but we begin with WRO's Monica Casey, who is on the Outer Banks right now. Monica set the scene there for us. Yeah, Jeff, it is definitely still raining out here, but the real issue right now, I'm sure you can see, is the wind. If you take a look behind me at the ocean itself, tons of huge waves and white caps. We have seen some people out here on the pier who have quickly turned around to get back. A lot of sand blowing around right now. Really an uncomfortable day to be outside. I spoke with a couple of surfers who came here earlier this week. This is definitely not water you can get in right now. But these two men came up from South Carolina on Monday chasing those big swells that come before the storm. It's, it's the camaraderie with, with your friends and being out there and getting that experience. Um, you know, surfing all my life, uh, love surfing, been to a lot of places around the world, but Outer Banks is a special place. And although today is a total washout for people vacationing here, everyone's had a pretty good attitude about this. The Dare County Sheriff's Office says all roads on Roanoke Island are clear and passable. There is about a, a foot of water on Hatteras Island near Sandy Bay right now. And John, if we can come this way for just a moment, I want to show you all of this sand blowing in that direction. That is what things have been like. Obviously, you see the red no swimming sign. We are really the only ones standing here on this beach right now. Uh, not surprising considering the conditions we're having. Jeff? Certainly we can see that Italian not quite done on the Outer Banks for us. Monica Casey live this noon. Thank you.